everybody, thanks for checking out the video. I'm just gonna quickly go over my in-stock trades purchase. If you don't know, instocktrades.com, associated with Discount Comic Book Surf, DCBS, and they do a lot of um, half price, 45% off sales on hardcovers, trade paperbacks, single issues. So I actually took kind of a big risk. My wife and I have a budget. So at the end of the month, I was looking to pick up the Jeff Johns Green Lantern Omnibus, which spoiler I got. Because it was so tight in the budget, I ended up purchasing a damaged copy. I'm assuming they're books that people receive and then they have a policy where you can ship them back if they're damaged. They offer these damaged copies uh, for a lower price. So if it's 45% off, it might be 50% off. Usually between five and 8% more off on the book. When you get to a book like this, uh, where the sticker price is $125, that can make a big difference. I ended up kind of taking a leap of faith here on uh, buying a damaged copy. And so I just want to kind of share my experience with you guys, show you the book so you can see it. Uh, maybe you guys can pick up a damaged copy of In Stock Trades because it is a little bit of a risk. They have a no return policy. So if you purchase a damaged book, you can't return it. They will not replace it with a better copy. So with a book this expensive, I was a little bit nervous. So I just want to show you guys what the book looks like. I uh, just want to talk to you about my experience. So thanks for watching. Enjoy. So really quick, uh, I bought two items uh, in this purchase order. I got the Flash Deluxe hardcover. This was brand new, so this came packaged like every in stock trades. It was wrapped. It's a beautiful shape. This one came fine. So this is the omnibus that I got. It came wrapped, so it wasn't open. And then I actually put this on my bookshelf so you could see the plastic kind of tore a little bit in the corner. So that wasn't them, that was that was me. I did that. As best I can see so far, the corners look like they're dinged up a little bit. Everything else looks good. The book's in really good shape. So I'm gonna crack it open. Um, let's just see what it looks like. Okay, so I've opened it up, I've given a look over, and so now on the screen I'm just gonna put up some pictures of maybe some of the defects that came with this book, and I'll kind of give you my final evaluation or recommendation. Right away I'll tell you that there's nothing wrong with the dust jacket inside or out. There is a little bit of folding along one edge, but the dust jacket's fine. The actual cover, the hard cover, the corners are a little bit damaged. Um, one of the biggest ones was in the back top right corner. Had some damage to it. Looks like maybe it just got damaged in shipping, but again, that wouldn't be when I received it, it'd be when the initial person received it. The top pages have a little bit of, it looks like staining or glue. So that could just be from the packaging or I'm not quite sure. It's not very much, just a couple spots. The spine is intact, it's connected in the back corner. Um, on the front and back, and all the pages are connected in the book. None of them are loose, none of them are falling out. And the inside of the book, all the pages are clean, flat, none are inappropriately cut. There is no damage to the pages inside the book. And so that's it. That's really all the flaws I could find with this book. My best guess is that it was a book that was shipped. Maybe it was damaged during shipping the corner. And obviously if you pay a lot of money for these books, people send them back because they want them in. Uh, pristine condition. If you're okay with a, a damaged corner, just some slight defects on the dust jacket or the cover itself, this is probably something you want to pursue. I don't know how trade paperbacks handle it. The only reason I think that it wasn't shipping to me is because, again, my flash hardcover came with zero damage. If you're okay with a couple dinged up corners, maybe blemish uh, somewhere on the book, I think this is something maybe worth pursuing. I will definitely do this again. For me, I just really want to read the series. I'm okay with it being a little bit damaged as long as it's readable and it's all a copy that will stay together, which I think this is as good of a copy in that regard as one that you would get um, from them regularly. If you've bought a damaged book from In Stock Trades, how did yours show up? If this is something you're interested in, is there a limit? Because this one cost me a little bit of money. It was a really big risk for me. So again, thanks for watching guys. If uh, I highly recommend In Stock Trades. Uh, they're a great company. They ship things pretty quickly. I'm really excited to get into this story. Thanks for watching. Let me know your thoughts, your experiences, and uh, stay tuned. Thanks. Bye.